What's up, everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Saturday Fatterday. I'm here in Gilbert, Arizona at El Taco Santo. Now, Arizona is known for great tacos. These guys started in a food truck, opened up their first location in Awatuki, and now has this brand new location here in Gilbert. Uh, they're known for their carne asada tacos. So let's get inside and check it out. Hey everyone, we are inside El Taco Santo in the brand new Gilbert location. It's a very pretty yeah, Gilbert yeah, location. It's really it's nice. Very modern. It's, I love all the shiplap all over. It's decided. decorated very well. Yeah. And, and uh, you know, we haven't done we real haven't, Mexican we food on the channel. This is the first yeah, one. We haven't. Yeah. Now we're in Arizona. We have amazing <laughs> Mexican food. It's like, food. It's, what do you yeah. choose? Um, but this is more of a Sonoran style. So we love Sonoran dogs. So I try to find everywhere that has a Sonoran dog. And uh, that's kind of what led me here at the beginning. Yeah. A Sonoran dog. Sonoran dog. Well, yeah. and the food so, looks good. So let's yeah. start with something. Okay, We're going to take go. it off with. All right. Uh, carne asada fries? Sure. Sure. Because it's carne asada fries. Carne asada fries. All right. Damien, you have a fork? There you go, Damien. All right. Grab that. All right. This is loaded. This is a lot. Oh, man. They love the like orders. Yeah. This is. This is a lot of food. Uh, so this looks okay. like what? Carne asada fries. Is the cheese fries. melted on the fries? Is it melted cheese or the canned cheese? All right, let's melt it. All right, let's melt it. Here we it. go. There you go. All right. Hmm. I like that cheese. Mm. The cheese flavor is nice. Oh, wow. It tastes different than your normal carne asada fries. The cheese tastes better. The cheese is really good. Yeah. Very gooey. I don't know. I'm like I gotta say it. The, the cheese is not the best part of this. It's the carne, the carne asada. <laughs> I like the cheese flavor. Mm -hmm. You know what? Touche, Dave. Um, that's good. Mm. So they started off as a carne asada taco truck. So you, you know the carne asada mm -hmm. has to carne be asada, asada, right? Mm -hmm. well, right. Carne asada is good. Right. Well, then let's move on to this guy then. Because he's right next door. The El Santo Burro. Yes. This is their burrito. And we get to break this up in many pieces. It's big, it's toasted. Oh, it's got like Ooh, it's roasted got a, pepper. Yeah, look at that oh, pepper. Wow, it's a big piece pepper. of roasted pepper. Beautiful. And you guys hot. got all my pepper. It's hot, it's crispy. <laughs> this looks Okay, I'm gonna have it without nice. sauce first. I'm gonna add some hot sauce. Yeah, I'm just gonna eat it just like this. There you go. All right. Boro. Mmm. 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 Oh, good. Oh, yeah. Add a little bit of that habanero salsa. It's different than your normal That's burritos good. because it's like toasted. Mm. It's crispy. And the, the carne asada is mm. obviously good. It's so good. Mm. That roasted pepper. I love the pepper in there. Mm. I wonder if this is well, Sonoran a nice style. Kick to it. I wonder if it's because it's Sonoran style. Oh man. Mm. So wow. good. Whoa. I don't know if I want to eat anything guys. else. This is really, hey, really good. That mango habanero salsa? It is. Mm -hmm. It is pretty Wait, sorry. That's a mango. Just have just habanero, salsa. habanero salsa. Wow. Yeah, it's got some really good kick that, to it. Mm. Excellent. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. And they also have um, habanero onions Ooh. in the um, salsa bar. It's awesome. Wow, that's really good. I didn't expect that to be so awesome. Um, All right. Well, do we want to hit this guy? Mm -hmm. Let's do it. <laughs> this is the <sighs> Lorenza. Lorenza. So basically, it's a Sonoran style. Toasted, crispy, crispy fried corn tortilla. It's a tostada basically, but using a torn corn tortilla. And I don't know how I'm gonna break this. Just break it. So, oh, just break it. Oh, look at that cheese stretch. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is hard. This is very hard to We're do. We're just gonna get down this and dirty. Very guys. crispy. But look at the big thing of cheese at the bottom that's melted. Oh, yeah. that looks so look good. at that. Oh, I'm gonna reach across, gonna reach wow. across. We're eating handheld tacos anyway, guys. So and some cheese. I'm gonna add some of this meat. habanero sauce to it. Yeah. All right. All right, here we go. That. Ready? So habanero cheese sauce on and everything yeah. in oh, here. Oh man, it's just so good. Oh man. All right. All right, here we go. Let's go. Mmm. 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 Wow. That's crisp. It's crazy. Mmm. Mm. Oh man. That was an eye closer right there. Ooh, so good. Wow. Probably good. It's so crispy. Mm. Again, the carne asada. 
That carne asada is so it's good. Funny. Mm -hmm. Guys, that that crisp, that's amazing. Wow. The Lorenza, Lorenza, we love you. Yeah. <laughs> um, all right, Sonoran dog time. Okay. All right, let's do it. Sonoran dog. All right. You get to the in there. I think that's his ears, or is it? I will. Oh, wait, that's mine. That's my dog. All right. You grab that, dog. grab it, grab, grab it. Up. <laughs> and they have a little pepper in here. I think they said Guerra pepper. I'm gonna put some on. Because it's a Sonoran dog, it's nice and loaded there you with go. everything. The Sonoran bacon. dog, yeah. Bacon inside. Bacon. Oh. All right. There you go, go guys. Mmm. Mmm. A little sweet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, bread is sweet. All right, where's the bread? The bread is sweet. Oh, yeah, it is. That's nice. It's it like a Hawaiian roll sweet. Really good. With that bacon, super crispy. Um, mm. Oh, it's just falling everywhere. I'm so happy. Wow. Mm. It's so messy. Mmm. Mm. Mm. I've had Sonoran dogs. I think this is probably one of one of the top wines for, for sure. sure. Mm -hmm. Because of that sweet bread, that totally stands out. The yeah. extra crispy bacon. The hands are a mess. <laughs> <Yeah>. Habanero. <laughs> I'm not gonna touch anything. But all right. Well, while we have habanero, let's try this. The refried beans that they have here are habanero flavored, and Those. it's super, super creamy. It yeah, almost looks like a sauce. Super smooth blend. It's like, look at that. All right, all right. Let's try. I love refried go. beans, but habanero. Yep. Habanero. So. It's almost like mashed potatoes. <laughs> it's so smooth. Mm, and then you get that little bit little of little bit of a in. kick at the end. Little bit of a kick. little. It's very very faint. It's not too. I guess they have to make it for everybody, right? So this is this is like it's almost like sour cream. It's so light, it's so and smooth, and so smooth. Look at this. This mm. is not like if he if he didn't tell us refried breeds, you'd have to guess like what is. I just you can just eat it like this, or you just put it on your tacos. Yeah, or yeah. I don't dip your food in it. It's good. <laughs> it's good. Oh man. Mm. Oh. All right. Well, well, we're here at El Taco Santo, so, so let's get. We gotta do tacos. Gotta tacos. Do tacos. All right. So we got three kinds okay. of tacos here. Which ones we're gonna start with? Well, the cochinita pibil. All right. I think I did that right. <laughs> it is a uh, more of a Sonoran style. He said it was like a slow roasted pork. So it reminds me of like media, but with pork. So. Okay. So first of all, it, it comes just with the meat and the tortilla. And then yeah. they have a uh, salsa bar with a lot of choices. And you can make make this your own, And right? the containers for the salsa bar are big. You don't need to make like 10 little ones. Yeah. You just make two massive ones. So even though we have the same tacos, ours are all different. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, all yeah, different. yeah we, I think, we, but I think we, we put we, di different picks in there. Yeah, narrowed them all out. Yeah, yeah, you gotta. You gotta put some all right, So this is the cochinita. Everybody got that? Yeah. There we go. The pibil. There we go. All right. Mm. This dripping is so juicy. And the habanero mm. onion. Mm. 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 That's very tasty. So you won't get that one at normal Mexican restaurants. Wow. This place is really good. Oh wow. Yep. But the amount of taco places that we can go to, this is really good. So saying the carne asada no. was good. Th this is this is it's different too. different it's i mean it's better mm. yeah oh mm. okay let's go back to carne asada then because <laughs> you said it all right we, got the we already asada. know how good their carne asada is here <laughs> look at how much meat they put in these things <laughs> it's just falling out that's another thing it's packed with meat no. And they're not normal street tacos. These are bigger than yeah. your normal street taco. Well, they put way more meat in there, yeah. that's for sure. But the that's size cool. of the, the tortilla itself too. Mm -hmm. But he said that um, all the meat ones, he gives flour tortillas. And then all the pork ones, they give corn, unless you ask for something different. So this one's a flour tortilla. The flour's yeah. a little thinner. Yeah, a little thinner. All right, all right here we go. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Mm. I mean, this is what they're known for. You see why? Oh, mm. delicious. I think I dropped steak in my shoe. There's so much steak in here. 
It was mm. excellent, man. It's really, really good. And we're kind of scared to do Mexican restaurants because we have so many. And it's like, how do you choose? What's somebody gonna say about it? But I'm glad we chose this as our first, guys, because yeah. <clears throat> this one is good. Excellent. Great recommendation. Mm. Okay. All right, last last taco. All right. I'm gonna say I saved my favorite for last on purpose. <laughs> oh, of course he did. I love Bidia. And this is Bidia in the uh, corn tortilla. And once again, there's so also much meat, so man. Packed. Unreal. Right. Yeah, it's, it's so full. All right, guys. Already Bidia. dripping before I buy it. Hey, look at the dripping. Look at that. Look how beautiful. All it's right. such a mess. Let's yeah. go. All right, Bidia. Oh my God. <laughs> Man. Mm -hmm. So it's juicy. So juicy, so tender. There's so much meat. Mm. This is crazy. Oh man. If you like video, this this is some amazing video. So good. Mm. That's okay. This is an excellent, excellent, excellent taco spot. Yeah, I've been, I've been to some really good taco spots here in yeah, Phoenix. A lot. Yeah, this this is on mm. up there. This is up there for sure. Look at the mess. <laughs> oh, but this one stands out to me because of habanero. They have yeah. habanero in so many different ways. And I love habanero. But man. <laughs> All right. Well, <laughs> here we go. I mean, I'm feeling the habanero now in my mouth. Yep. It's beautiful. It's, yeah, it's good. Mm. It's good. This they, is, they didn't water it down. It's this is good heat. This is yeah, legit. This is full meats. Like they don't cheap out on yeah. anything. And the prices here are very very reasonable. All right. So brand new location here in Gilbert, Arizona. Come on, check them out. It's close to downtown Gilbert. Yeah. Come on, guys. Yeah, exactly. Give it a try. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah. not too close where you can't get parking. It's yeah, <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Parking is great. Yeah, good parking <laughs> here. So yeah, guys, remember smash that like button, subscribe for more content, ring that bell. And we'll catch you next Saturday, Saturday. Take care, guys. Bye. Okay, guys. So obviously, we need to get our dessert right after. And uh, in the same plaza as El Taco Santo is Jeremiah's. And we love Jeremiah's Italian ice. So they have a seasonal special that I got right here, which is a candy cane gelati, which is part frozen. Um, gelato and part um, ice cream mixed together with crushed candy cane on top. Okay. And I got the strawberry shortcake, which is not, it is not on the menu. It's you ridiculous. have to ask for it, but yeah, this is pretty that ridiculous. Is ridiculous. And these, they're awesome. If you guys have never had Jeremiah's Italian ice, it's it's something, guys. You guys gotta try this. Ah. Yep. Mm. Mm. Oh, good. Mm.